My name is Len Thompson. I'm the president of Cold Steel Incorporated. What we intend to do in this presentation is prove that our knives are unsurpassed when it comes to strength, sharpness, and cutting power. Many of the demonstrations you are going to see are very, very dangerous and constitute gross abuse of the knife. Please do not attempt to duplicate these at home. Some of our tests are self-explanatory, but others you may not be familiar with, so we thought we'd give you a brief explanation. This rope is very tough and abrasive. We use it to demonstrate the cutting power and edge retention of our knives. In our experience, the vast majority of factory and handmade knives are unable to sever even a single one-inch strand of free-hanging manila rope. This rope is over two inches thick and is braided together out of 240 polypropylene strands. It is very tough and strong and is widely used as mooring line for ships. Hammering a knife into a hard maple block and then snapping it out sharply to the side is an extreme test of point strength. Virtually all other knives fail this test by bending or breaking. Most knives will shatter when flexed in a vise with mere hand pressure. We go to the extreme by adding the leverage of a three-foot pipe. We know of no factory or handmade knife that can duplicate the toughness of a cold steel blade. Piercing a car door or hood is a tangible way to demonstrate the extreme point strength and penetration of our blades. Please notice our knives are remarkably unaffected by this ordeal. Hitting the back of the blade of a folding knife smartly on the edge of a table is an extreme test of its lock strength. Most folding knives fail this test. Locking a folding knife blade in a vise and suspending a heavy weight from its handle is another very severe test of its lock strength. A huge number of knives are unable to support 40 pounds or less. Flexing the blade of a folding knife in a vise by hand or with the added leverage of a steel pipe is a radical test of its overall strength and construction. The Trailmaster is the strongest, sharpest boy knife available at any price. It will outperform by a huge margin any other factory or handmade knife we know of. We know we're going out on a limb with this proclamation, but unlike our competitors, we have indisputable proof of its incredible abilities. We know of no other buoy knife that can duplicate this feat.
The Kukri has been made famous throughout the world by Nepal's ferocious Gurkha mercenaries who have used it to strike fear into the hearts of Great Britain's enemies around the world. Now Cold Steel is pleased to present our version of this historic knife called the LTC Kukri. The blade is made out of our famous carbon-5 steel and it will outcut any knife its size in the world. We know of no other factory or handmade knife that can accomplish this. This is our plainsman's tomahawk. Like all of our tomahawks, it's drop forged from 5150 steel. The edge is hardened and the body of the head is left soft to take the shock. These tomahawks come sharp, but they can be made razor, razor sharp, which I'm going to demonstrate. Drop forged out of 5150 steel, the Rifleman's Hawk is an extremely heavy duty affair. Weighing in at 32 ounces, it hits like a ton of bricks when thrown and can easily fill in for a full size axe or hammer when chopping wood or driving nails. The Plainsman's Hawk features traditional frontier styling and a lighter weight package. The blade is 5 inches long for deep penetration and 3.5 inches wide for serious chopping and throwing potential. The Vietnam Tomahawk was designed by Peter Lagana for use by U.S. troops in Vietnam. 
Our version follows the original as faithfully as possible. The head is drop forged out of 5150 medium carbon steel and differentially heat treated for strength. The Bush Ranger was designed by Lynn Thompson to fill the need for a rugged, lightweight sheath knife that's large enough and strong enough to get the job done in an emergency without being a burden to wear on the belt every day. Backed by the strength of its carbon-5 steel blade, the Recon Tanto is redefining the standard for combat knives. It is fast becoming the preferred fixed blade for SWAT teams and special military units. At 3 16 of an inch thick, the SRK offers the sturdiest possible point and edge configuration in keeping with its mission as a survival rescue knife.
The Master Hunter's broad, thick blade has been flat ground extra thin with a distinct distal taper for unprecedented cutting ability, edge retention, and ease of resharpening. The Voyager lockback folders are available in 5-inch, 4-inch, and 3-inch blade lengths. They all feature lightweight Zytel handles, extra strong locks, and precision ground high polish AUS 8A blades. They are the strongest, sharpest lockbacks in their class and will outcut any competitor. Four MT holds forty five pounds. Four LTS severs one and three quarter inches of rope. LT 
holds 60 pounds yet weighs only 3.3 ounces. holds 100 pounds, yet weighs only 4.8 ounces. The Vaquero is the largest, strongest, lightweight folder on the market. Its six inch Nogales clip point blade with its sinuous double curve is wickedly effective and its lock offers unprecedented strength. Vaquero makes knife history by severing three inches of rope. No other folding knife has ever accomplished this feat. Vaquero holds 125 pounds, yet weighs only 6.2 ounces. The history and use of spears spans every corner of the globe. Even today, it is common to find people around the world who rely on the spear for food and protection. Now with cold forging technology pioneered by cold steel, we can offer high performance thrusting and throwing spears at very reasonable prices.
The javelin is a lightweight, long-range throwing spear. It's a lot of fun to throw at targets and makes a formidable hunting and survival tool. Invented by the legendary Zulu King Shaka, the Asangai's long broad blade and short handle make it ideal for thrusting. Our interpretation is closely modeled after an original in Lynn Thompson's collection. All we have done is made it massively stronger by using super tough 1035 medium carbon steel, cold forging technology, and a socket to accept the traditional two foot long handle. This is our Asengai spearhead. Sometimes you don't have a handle or you broke your handle and uh, all you have left is the head, but that doesn't mean that you're out of business. You still have a very formidable tool and weapon in your hand. Makes a great improvised short sword. And as I mentioned before, while it's not designed primarily for slashing, it does do a pretty good job. The long Asengai is identical to the short, except we have equipped it with a five and a half foot shaft to give it more range for throwing and more reach for thrusting. This is our boar spear. As you can see, it's a big stout spear. I'm five foot eight, so it's about six and a half feet or more tall. The shaft of the spear is made out of premium American ash. It's one and a half inches in diameter. And the head is drop forged out of 1035 medium carbon steel with a spring temper. The whole spear and shaft together weigh four and a quarter pounds, so it's a pretty heavy spear. It's generally not thrown at very long ranges. Uh, 15 feet, 20 feet, up to 30 feet is about the maximum range to throw this heavy spear. As you can see, it has double lugs here. This is to keep the spear from over penetrating. When you make an insertion on a large animal like a, a European boar that can weigh up to 400 pounds, you don't want him to run up the spear shaft and bore you. So this is to prevent that from happening. We're going to be throwing some of our spears at this 55 gallon steel drum full of water. Uh, these drums are quite tough, they're work hardened and they have a round surface that deflects things quite easily. So I'm going to throw them hard and I want to demonstrate the penetration of these spears. When it comes to cutting, slashing, or piercing, 
the Cold Steel Tantos can't be beat. There is no factory or custom knife that can begin to approach their legendary toughness and now you can see why. After 15 years of production, no one has challenged this claim. Just a few ounces heavier than the Tanto, the Magnum Tanto provides a dramatic increase in cutting power. Combine this with the visual impact of a Tsuba style sword guard and you have perhaps the ideal Tanto. The Magnum Tanto is available with a 7.5 inch or 9 inch blade made of Sanmai 3 steel. The Magnum Tanto with a 9 inch blade severs 3 inches of rope. The Master Tanto shares all the features of the regular Tanto except that it has a blade made from Cold Steel's exclusive Sanmai 3 steel. This steel is a three-piece stainless laminate with a hard core in the middle and two spring-tempered pieces on each side for maximum support under stress. This is the knife that started the Cold Steel Legend. It features a 6 inch long blade with reinforced point, stainless guard, craton grip and a skull crushing pommel. Complete with all stainless fittings, including a traditional oval guard, the Mini Tanto scale down to the smallest practical size. The result? A perfect boot belt knife.
Delta Dart is injection molded from 43% fiberglass filled nylon called Zytel. The blade forms a triangle when viewed in cross section and the point is quite tough yet acute enough to offer excellent penetration. The CAT, or Covert Action Tanto, is a Zytel reproduction of Cold Steel's famous Tanto. It shares all of the same design features and makes a terrific letter opener or emergency self-defense tool. Tipping the scales at only four and a half ounces, the Coben's five and a half inch long blade offers fearsome piercing power and awesome cutting ability while being highly resistant to breakage or damage of any kind. The Culloden is Cold Steel's interpretation of the Scottish skein do or stocking knife traditionally worn by kilt-clad Highlanders. It features a 5-inch needle-sharp blade that is ideally suited for piercing and a razor-sharp edge as well. Cold Steel is proud to present the finest production-made push daggers in almost 150 years, the Safe Keepers. These knives feature unique non-slip craton handles and super strong blades ground extra thin at the edge for maximum piercing and slashing ability.
The True Flight Thrower features a 316 cents thick, high carbon steel blade with a strong spear point. For versatility, we grind each blade to a sharp utility edge that's plenty sharp, yet safe enough with care for those who prefer the blade held throwing technique. The torpedoes are an awful lot of fun to throw at targets. You can use them in uh, survival situations for uh, hunting small game or for dispatching varmints. And in emergency, they can also be used for self-defense. They hit really hard whether they hit on the point or on the flat. This light double-bladed throwing axe features the same cold forged construction of our spears and due to its design is remarkably easy to stick for novice and expert alike. Like its serpent namesake, the Taipan is aggressively fast and deadly. Designed by Lin C. Thompson in the distinctive Tanto style, the Taipan embodies all the best features of a classic dagger with none of its shortcomings. These double-edged knives will pierce like a stiletto and cut like a straight razor. Each blade has been carefully ground to an extra thin edge and hand honed until it will cut at the slightest touch. They are an ideal companion for all who must go in harm's way.
Emergency situations on land and sea often require an extra sharp knife. The blade of the ER-1 is hollow ground like a straight razor and has our exclusive serration pattern for smooth, long-lasting cutting power. As an added safety feature, the ER-1 has a sheep's foot point. This is particularly useful in accident situations for cutting away seat belts or heavy clothing where a more pointed blade is less desirable. Here we cut eight braid ship's cable consisting of 695 polypropylene strands. DR1 severs one inch rope, yet knife weighs only 1.6 ounces. This stainless steel knife with its injection molded Zytel sheath weighs just 1.3 ounces, yet the two inch spear point blade is three quarters of an inch wide, double hollow ground to a razor sharp edge, and equipped with aggressive serrations for efficient cutting on a wide range of materials.
This cutting dynamo is only half an ounce in weight and about two inches long overall, yet it delivers heavyweight performance. The razor sharp edge features our exclusive serration pattern, so it zips through a host of materials at unbelievable speed. The Hi Hojo is perfect for cooking, camping, fishing, boating, or wherever you need a sharp knife. Exactly like our kitchen knives, but in a handy 3 inch utility length. The high ho to a sever's one inch rope yet weighs only 2.4 ounces. The Lanti is the traditional walking stick and self-defense tool of India. It comes in 4 foot, 5 foot and 6 foot lengths with 4 foot being the standard police issue. Made of tough rattan, the Lantis are ideally suited for two-handed use, poking, jabbing, thrusting, pushing, whipping or delivering heavy strokes with the butt. The Black Bear's 8-inch blade offers excellent reach and incredible penetration with very little physical effort. And the subhelp practically eliminates the possibility of the hand being dislodged or coming into contact with the blade. Plus, as an added bonus, the subhelp facilitates rapid and effortless withdrawal after insertion. This knife design first appeared in 1942 and has seen action in every conflict around the globe. Now you can own an exact replica of this original classic at a markedly reduced price.
Our kitchen knives feature AUS 8A blades that are one and a half inches wide. They are flat ground from top to bottom and then honed to a serrated edge that is astoundingly sharp. Some people say you can't use a serrated knife to carve with. That may be true for some serration patterns, but I designed my serration pattern so that you could slice effectively with it. Here we have about a 15 pound turkey and I'm just going to do a very little bit of carving to illustrate the slicing capability of our 7 inch kitchen knife. For the money, the Bushman may very well be the strongest outdoor survival knife in the world. Unlike other hollow handle survival knives, there is no joint or seam between the blade and the handle that requires a mechanical fastener. Instead, the Bushman's blade and integral handle have been expertly cold forged out of a single piece of SK-5 high carbon steel. Our shovel is almost an exact replica of the Soviet Spetsnaz model. The only difference is we use thicker, tougher 1035 steel and a genuine hardwood handle.
In Africa, the schombok is a cattle prod, a whip, a riding crop, and a means of self-protection. And since the schombok is swung like a rod, not cracked like a bullwhip, the weight, speed, and flexibility of the schombok does all the work and little physical strength is required. 